Hi, it's Dr. Tracy, and today I'm going to be taking you or teaching you how to do EFT. So EFT stands for Emotional Freedom Technique. It's also known as tapping. So you tap on specific points on your body, and these are called acupressure points. And as you're tapping, you say a certain phrase, which I'll teach you as well, and it can be used to help with anxiety. It's also used to help with post-traumatic stress disorder, um, pain. It's been shown to help with pain, and but I used it mostly for anxiety when I came to it. I also think it's a great tool to cultivate self-love, self-esteem, um, because you'll see in the script how you, you learn to become accepting of yourself, regardless of your fear, or your worry, or anxiety. Okay, so first we'll go through the points. So here, this one is the karate chop point, and then the top of the head point, and then the inside of the eyebrow, the outside of the eyebrow, under the eye on that bony point, upper lip, this divot here above your chin, your collarbone, and then here, this is gonna be for women, right kind of where your bra line hits, it's about the midway between your rib cage. And then I also do the inner edge of the nail, so the inner edge of the pinky nail, ring finger, middle finger, pointer finger, and then this side of your thumb. And then I always end it back on the karate chop point. I use my pointer and my middle finger to actually do the tapping. And on each point, I'm tapping about five to seven times, maybe 10 times. It doesn't, there's, that's not, um, there's no science there in terms of how many times you need a point. The practice is moving through each point, tapping on each point a certain, you know, a few times, five to 10 times, I think is probably what's most commonly taught. And then saying your script. And this is something that can be used when you're having an acute emotion. So if you're feeling really anxious, you can use this to help calm you down and release that energy. Or you can also do it as a daily practice. So if you're having something that you, you would like to work through, say maybe a fear of spiders, a fear of public speaking, then you can do this when you're not having that acute situation upon you. And this is a great way to release that fear, release that energy so that is less likely to come up and overwhelm you in the future. So, um, and let's see, so we're gonna start with, oh, the script. So all of the scripts are gonna be, even though I blank, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. And so you're gonna say that as you tap, and it may change as you're saying it, you may start out with something and then you realize, oh, wait a second, that's actually not the root of the problem. So. Let's use a public speak, public fear of public speaking because that's a big one for a lot of people. So even though I'm afraid to give my presentation at work today, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I'm afraid to speak in front of everyone, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I'm afraid of what people may think of me, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I'm, I don't think I'm good at public speaking, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I'm worried about public, speak, public speaking, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I'm fearful of speaking in public, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I don't have the confidence to speak in public, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I'm afraid I'm gonna say something really stupid, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I'm scared of public speaking, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I'm worried what people will think of me, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. And that's it. <laughs> so how easy and simple is that? And it's effective, which is great because I love easy and simple and effective tools. <laughs> Those things are wonderful. So that was a very brief introduction to EFT. I'll post some more videos that will go into depth on other ways that you can use it, but here's just sort of a starter course. Let me know if you have any questions or comments below. I'd love to hear from you. Thank you.